doing? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to give you a little bit of history about Miami while we have fun on an amazing boat ride. So keep watching. Officially, the city of Miami is a metropolis located in southeastern Florida in the United States. It is the third most populous metropolis on the East Coast and is the seventh largest in the country. The city is an economic powerhouse serving as the financial and business capital of Latin America. It is also a major center and leader in finance, commerce, culture, arts, and international trade. And it's also the largest city with a Cuban-American influence. The Tequesta tribe occupied the Miami area for around 2,000 years before contact with Europeans. A village of a hundreds of people dating to 500-600 BC was located at the mouth of the Miami River, which is the same river you are seeing right now on my video. It is believed that the entire tribe migrated to Cuba. Spain and Britain ruled Florida until Spain ceded it to the United States back in 1821. Therefore, the Spanish influence in the historical neighborhood Coral Gables, which is in fact one of my favorite ones, not only to live, but also to walk around and visit the amazing parks with trees that age more than 200 years. Port Miami is the busiest cruise port in the world, and it refers to itself as the cruise capital of the world. Miami is also a major tourism hub for international visitors, ranking second in the country after New York City. Those buildings you see right in the back are Fisher Island and South Beach, and the sandbar is called Key Biscayne. Usually a lot of boats hang around this area, but during the week it's a little bit more quiet, just the way I like it. Do you see these buildings right behind my back? Well, in one of these buildings is where I used to live for seven years back in the days. Now I am staying in this same area in one of those buildings and very soon I will do a beautiful video about the place where I'm staying right here in Miami for a few more months before I go back to Los Angeles, my second home. Miami to me is just a magical paradise. Right now, the entire country is in the middle of winter and it feels just like summer right here in Miami. Even the water has the perfect temperature. Miami is noted as the only major city in the United States founded by a woman named Julia Tottle. The city's nickname, the Magic City, came from its rapid growth, which was noticed by winter visitors who remarked that the city grew so much from one year to the next 
that it was just like magic. After Fidel Castro rose to power in Cuba following the revolution in 1959, many wealthy Cubans sought refuge in Miami for their increasing the city's population. This was my brief history of the place that I love. Well guys, this is the end of this episode. If you guys like this video, you know what to do. Subscribe to my channel, leave a comment, and see you next time. Ciao, ciao.